Alright, hello, Mr. Niren here. Welcome to Gladiator Begins. It's a new day. So I'm gonna create a new character named Medea. I've disabled the sheets, but I don't know. Uh, the money sheet might be on anyway. You'll see. So the name is Medea. She's a uh, vanilla character that you can play as once you have beaten the game once. So uh, in, in multiplayer she has a, a really cool helmet, really cool weapons, and really cool uh, gauntlets and shoulder pads and such. But in uh, single player you need to start from scratch. However, we have already like uh, gotten access to all the skills. We can give them the, their um, unique skills immediately. So in multiplayer it's possible to start battle with this character and she has the same stats as in the game and you fight her in the game, she's a boss in the game and uh, yeah, then uh, when you play as her in multiplayer or against the AI in exhibition mode uh, then in the battle arena then uh, you can click on start and check her stats and see what gear she has and her stats and such, her skills so I have already copied that I wanted to re remake the first scene here so we will immediately jump to the stats we will move everything down to 5 in terms of vitality or health or endurance which affects skills vitality affects your constitution to endure more damage endurance affects your endurance to love more skill attacks strength <coughs> Affects your damage dealt uh, and weight limits. We want this maximum. So the or original character, I believe, had 209 of these two and 269 of this. So we want 69 more in strength than in the other two areas. Okay, we will create a character. She looks kind of Egyptian, but that origin didn't exist in this game. So I believe she's a Median girl. I used the media as her origin. It wasn't stated with the character, but I would guess from the media. Let's start the game. So I played a few battles as this character in in the battle arena, and uh, she has really good moves. She uses two twin blades, and is very acrobatic in her fighting style. I liked playing her as her. So I wanted to create a character based on her. She also is the best looking female of the original game. Okay, creating gladiator from media called Medel Medea. Proceed, yes. Alright, then we can see the stats here. Medea, Equarters Palace, Talent 5, Endurance 6, Strength 39, we have a lot of depth. We also have a lot of money because the sheet for some reason is active with this. I, I loaded the save file for Crashius uh, that I downloaded from the internet and I believe for some reason I've saved that save file with the sheeting on for money. So we have a lot of money. Okay, we will go to my room. Statistics can be seen here as well. See all the details. We haven't done anything yet in the game. When it comes to the nickname we can change some stuff. Change this to Nimidea and uh, this to her brilliant goddess nickname. It's the nickname used by the character. Uses Medea equipment, strikes with double claw. Okay. Um, and then we do not have any items yet. We'll go to the skill panel. We'll change our skills. So triangle should be double claw for Medea. Double close. So all the skills are different moves. 
can have four different moves equipped at once. They can all be leveled up to level 25 or level level 30. So double claw and then uh, high kick, I believe. It's the second attack first. And then she had uh, step slash, I believe. And then she had twin spikes, I think. Bikes. All right, and that's the character. She looks like this. She saw. But there, yeah, brilliant goddess. We won't save the game. We will load new game and load Medea. I had already created her. Fortunately, she has a lot of money. I don't know how to deactivate that. Okay. We'll go... Uh, if we check the skill panel. We have double claw, high kicks, step slash, and twin spikes. Okay, let's go to the world map. Yes. Oi! can uh, skip uh. this. So I've already done this in two other videos. We jump straight to the battle. Okay, we can go to the armor, buy some stuff. Perk is new. Perk is new. Look for her items. So I wanted to play without using any sheets, so without using the money sheet, but unfortunately it was already activated. Had no choice but to use it. have uh, the maximum stats I should be able to buy her best stuff too leather cow riveted galea no I don't believe we have access to the stuff I don't have uh, all the shops open I do not have all her gear at the start of the game. Okay. Lay of Mars. We have a lot of uh, rare equipment here. So I don't know, we might actually have most stuff. It's not the stuff that she wear or wore in the multiplayer battle. That's kind of disappointing. Soon, I think we, we need to. I think about we we'll go to sheets. And uh, look shops. And we'll go back to the game. 
Load the game. Load her again. Load the world map. Yes. Oi. Oi. Hmm. If we click start, we can skip all that talking. Go to the armor. If we're unlucky, it still won't work. Exactly what in uh, what uh, helmet I want. But it's not certain that we will find it here. If that's the case, we'll have to go for other equipment, and that sucks. But I believe we have more uh, uh, items now. Here it is. This is her helmet, Hippolyte Galea. So if you play without using the sheet to enable all shops at the start of the game, then we can't get her unique equipment in the beginning. And we'll need to probably uh, get further into the game before we can get her stuff. Now I can get her helmet here. And uh, can get her other stuff. All her stuff start with the same uh, word. So Hippolyte knife is her weapon. All her stuff starts with Hippolyte. She had two of these. Had no shield. Then she had uh, any Hippolyte. Item you can find should be this character's item. A light gauntlet and manica. Okay. Then she had two. Uh, Identical pieces for the legs. Light Crea. Okay, and we're done. They don't need any other items. Okay. It looks like this right now. Space for it. 34 out of 90. Yeah, can add some more stuff. And uh, now we have too much. Participate in a battle, team battle. Start the game. <laughs> Skip this, the talking. Still need to level up before we can use all the equipment.
some really cool uh, battlefields in this game. When, when you have beaten the game once, you can play on all the battlefields um, in this game, in multiplayer in, and in uh, the exhibition mode. And uh, some of the stages are much more zoomed in on the characters. Some of them are fun versus fun only. You need to go to options. And uh, lower the volume a bit. Oh, we could uh, zoom in on the character. Let's go back. We can play like this. Awesome. Didn't know that. I prefer uh, zoomed in battles. It's more epic. Yeah, I didn't want money sheet at the beginning, but I uh, had already fucked up the save file, so we got it automatically. Yeah, I did want her gear to... we couldn't equip everything immediately. Greatest hit chain 5, somewhat accurate attacks, unable to dodge it all, simply disappointing, nothing memorable. Okay, we'll just take some pieces here. Ha, ah. mm. Skip the text. The status, reinforce abilities. And... Uh, right. And we'll go to the world map immediately. Oi. Skip the text, go to items. Uh, we'll check status 79 out of 93. Okay, so we have uh, 14 slots open. I don't think that's enough. We need the uh, 34 the helmet, 39 for the Hippolyte Manica, 33 for these. We can't have any of the new equipment. We don't want to use the Gladius, Gladius. so the Hippolyte knives cost 13,490. The helmet, the Hippolyte Galea, cost 10,900. Hippolyte Gauntlet cost 3,120, that's not too much. Hippolyte Manica cost 8,900. And the Hippolyte Okreya cost 8,900 each. So we could have uh, played with that money sheet and it would have taken not that long to, to get the stuff. But, um, anyway. We are rich at the start of the game, but the money is decreasing, we don't have unlimited money, but we had the maximum amount. Uh, as for uh, skills, we need to build up in the arena, we'll do that. Let's go to the battle royale. Yeah. 
to them. It'll take a while until I get good at this game. She was easier to, to use when she had all her equipment and uh, was more leveled up. Yeah. The accurate attacks not that great at dodging, has some potential. Okay, we can go for the painted wood. Better see. And the leather club. We are almost dead, we do not have a lot of health, so we'll heal. And we will go for the survival. We will just have to survive. A bunch of enemies showing up. So we'll try to kill as many as we can without dying. We have very little health, uh, very low health. So we can't take too many risks. Attacks and able to dodge it all. Very quick and accurate. Okay. Get the weapon. And the wheel. Heal the wounds. Still only have two retries. Let's uh, turn to the stable. Skip this talking. Day three. Okay. Items. No, we'll go to the status and reinforce. We'll increase our health. For the skills, don't know if we can reinforce.
some of my we can add. Active double claw. Seventeen of steep slash. Okay, then we don't want thirty there. Seventeen. Seventeen. Okay. Try ten in each. Twelve in each. Thirteen. Oh, we can add a lot of scales here. Fifteen. Eighteen in one, seventeen in the others. Here we could have more. Thirty. Okay, we're done. Our skills are now better. Okay, we're done here too. Status. Ninety-three. Let's go to reveal the map again. Very better skills, please. Oi. Let's participate in a battle royale. So the difference if I didn't use the money sheet is that we would have different various weapons. We would still have the skills. Use different weapons. It wouldn't be accurate. Here, we kill that guy too. Kill the ruin, good. I think 
it gets difficult to, to evade sometimes. I need to really hit the button at the right moment, like this. He's dead. Can't evade very well. Back attack. Ability. And uh, we wanted to increase the strength so we can carry more stuff. Status 94 out of 104. Alright, we won. 
Greatest hit chain. Five accurate attacks, not that great at all, Jing. Okay, has some potential. Leather mask. Let's pick it up. Little Kreia, let's pick it up too. How much space do we have? Three, four, seven. Item box. Okay, let's see. Twelve. We do not have enough space for that. Nine. Almost. We'll try to participate in another battle. Battle Royale. Yeah, it worked good. But it might slow us down. Kill them. Fuck you. Good. He died. We killed those two as well. And really good there. Yeah. Really well. Okay, greatest kill chain, 3, somewhat accurate attacks, very quick and accurate, nice. Okay, it went better this time. Uh, shield. Don't really need shields, but we'll take them anyway, we could sell them. Not that we need money. Pissipate, no shows, okay. Heal wounds. We'll still heal. Time to stable. Day 5. You almost played 6 days now. Hmm. Light with Callisto and the other character, Diana. Deleted the other character, Ella, because she was cheated. I mean, this one has money sheet. And I believe the uh, same was true for Diana. While Callisto was completely vanilla, no sheets. Uh, and this one also had, uh, I believe, uh, the public is a little bit more friendly to the player thanks to a sheet because I suck at dodging and in the vanilla game you need to dodge a lot in battles to gain the public's favor and I can avoid that by using a sheet okay so we will go to status reinforceability and uh, Strengths will be used. Okay. Now we have uh, another 15 weight total. So you can equip some more basic stuff. Okay, try to equip her helmet and see what happens. Okay, if we remove the leather or crea. Yeah, it worked. Good, then we will continue. Participate, team battle, yes. Now we have her helmet too. Come 
come on. It's almost easier when they are more difficult because they attack more often and it's easier to be prepared for their attacks than with the, with the parry skill. Fuck you. My ally killed the enemy. Ah, we get to face a new group. Attack simply disappointing, acceptable effort. Okay, I don't want that. Let's pick a weapon, maybe. Okay. Have enough health points, but we could have still heal ourselves. No, we don't bother. Participate. We'll do the survival mode. Almost won. Time is up. <coughs> great at kill chain 2. Very accurate attack, not that great at dodging. Very quick and accurate at well. Didn't kill too many. Use the sheep manic on the other hand. You can also say the character now. 
Yeah, if we had used no money sheet, it would have been a little bit more fun. Uh, so we would have needed to first save money before we can buy stuff. But uh, without the shops open, we wouldn't have been able to buy the right equipment until probably the late game. So, so at least that sheet needed to be gone. But the money sheet could have been left disabled. Would have been better. Let's go to the arena again. And uh, yeah, we'll participate the promotion test. Huh? We'll ah. skip this guy. I like that we could zoom in like this. Without good weapons, this guy is much harder to feed because you have to take way less damage. Fuck! We almost did it. Two more tries. We'll get the game over if we fail. Two more times. Huh? Ah. We'll just move straight to the battle. It's easier to kill when he doesn't have his helmet. So I don't want him to pick it up. Good, we won. If you can uh, remove his helmet, he's easier to kill. Good, we won. Somewhat accurate attack, simply disappointing, nothing memorable. Alright. Well, at least we won. We got a golden weapon, the bronze gladius. And a black Pelmula shield. Okay. No more games. Heal wounds. Yeah, we can heal, but we didn't lose that much. Let's return to the stable. Okay, day seven. Status, enforceability. Okay, items. Too much, I see. Can't use that yet. Leather 
Freya Sheep Manica Okay, status uh, 34 I think this is fine We'll save the game here Okay, we can go back to the title screen Battle Arena Exhibition Join Cassius and select Gladiator. <coughs> Place Medea and uh, Duel. We want to play in a more impressive duel area. Cassius Outpost. Our opponent be Callisto. Okay. Qualifying highest. And despair difficulty three. Let's start. camera zooms in in this battlefield Not that great at dodging, simply disappointing. Nothing memorable. Let's try again. On the east side, Medea, the brilliant goddess. And on the east, Callisto, the Tertillus Palace.
try to play as the other character against Medea. Least side Callisto, the Tartarius, Pius, and on the least side Medea, the brilliant goddess. Again, if you fail, you get in too many hits in the beginning. This, in this battle. Their feast in battle do better without the shield. And they can spam attacks. But of course, Medea has better weapons and helmets because she has the, the characters here. But this character only had basic stuff. Yeah, she can't win. Okay, L load another character, load Medea. And fight Diana. Fuck that. Okay. 
we will uh, try the real Medea against Diana. Gear, but also better stats, and they do quickly. Simply disappointing. Try again. Try to slow it down a bit. Take a lot of damage. strong these guys will be, they look strong, they'll probably be killed. Even if you can spam. 
Ross. Spam. Hit. He was too weak. I need a better character. Well, we will play two Mireya. Skip the intro. Options. Camera position should be A. Alright, change back. She moves much better now. Accurate attacks, unable to dodge at all, simply disappointing. Okay. Nothing memorable, that's because I didn't um, parry any of the attacks. Try again. I suck at parrying, that's the problem. Spam the attacks. Didn't go well in the, in the 
gaining this battle. much more difficult to defeat when they have their gear on. Rate of stage chain 8, some attack rate attacks can't evade very well, simply disappointing, blah blah blah. Okay. Let's change character. To the created Medea. We will fight her as well. Same stage. She doesn't have as good gear as you can see, and her stats are way worse. I believe she can't use her skills properly because she has so low uh, skill. Um, has placed, uh, I, I believe uh, the skill area, the endurance area, uh, if, if it's low you can't use your skills uh, a lot in battle, that's why she is far from as good. Uh, we need more uh, stats placed on, uh, on, on the endurance I believe, that's why she, she sucks in battle. She can't use her skills more than maybe once or twice uh, without being tired. We'll try again. Yeah, it's a clear difference. Try again. I believe it's because we have low skill level. She gets tired using her skills. Ah! 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 
again. It went very bad that time. Didn't like this fight. Try again. She does that uh, uppercut uh, when she's tired. We, we need your uh, attributes placed or action points placed in skill so she can do her special attacks more often. That's the difference between this character and the other one. She can't do her, her moves a lot. far from as fun to play as because she can't do her skills properly. Let's change the arena to the same underground and try this one instead. the same characters we should be able to win. We have the same gear and the same stats. The AI is obviously better but that's defending. Skills, 
started to spare me. Yes, better gear of course. The other one didn't have any money sheet, so she couldn't buy the best gear. She is about the same level. She didn't have all the skills unlocked either. Couldn't level them up as much. Look, let's let's try this one too. Yeah, another arena. The two versus two. Fight. 
kind of possible to have AI versus AI if you use toward the allied player. But uh, you need to defeat one opponent yourself or wait for her to take care of it for him. I believe I created a very weak character just so that I could kill him in one blow and then watch the AI. Okay, somewhat accurate attacks, not that great at dodging. Simply disappointing. So uh, then it would be like this. Have um, Tolithius here. He has only Vitality 5, Endurance 5, and Strength 5, and no equipment. So we'll see. We'll change Arena to Colosseum. Certain arenas can't be played with 2 versus 2. Uh, most of the arenas can only be played uh, in the duel mode, 1 versus 1. So now the, the second guy there should have uh, very little health. Let them fight each other. Here. Of course I can't kill him in one blow with uh, weak characters, but with a normal character you would be able to. Ready done. Medea is the better character. Okay. Do the other character. Yeah, no. And try this too. Diana will probably win. She is a very weak ally. Helmet. See, can try once more. Skip the intro. Managed to hit my own character. Public will go if that happens. Fuck that. She had really low health. Try again. Try to avoid hitting her own character. Good, we won! We can kill her, but she has a really dangerous attack. She only needs a few hits and we're dead. A great attacks ended too quickly, this is very simply disappointing. Okay. As for the gaming modes, we have uh, a bunch of different arenas. We have the Atelius Arena, 
where we can, uh, the smallest like dual arena, where we can fight all types of battles, dual mode, one versus one, battle royal, everyone versus everyone, and, and uh, survival, we will have uh, troops coming all the time and we will fight until we de are dead, I believe, and then team battle, we fight together with one uh, AI player against three AI uh, computer players. Two and two is what we already previewed. Then we have the war. They can't be played on the dual arenas. So we need to change arena. Well, look, this arena has all of these basic ones. And then uh, we have the Colosseum. Also have the basic ones. And they have the wars. So we have a unique war. Um, Gameplay, Warsama, Acti Actium, Alicia, Cillian, Igurta, German. So we can fight in some war scenarios if you have the Colosseum on. Colosseum Underground, then we only have Duel. And I believe the rest of the areas here are only Duel, one versus one. There are some really cool Duel stages. The only Colosseum allows the war. You can try a war run playing as Medea, but she is probably underpowered. And you need to unlock the, the war stuff and the extra duel stages. You get them when you have beaten the game and started from a scratch. The same way you unlock the characters. Gladiator who shall play as Hannibal Barca will attempt to break through the Roman encirclement. Okay, so we uh, will face a bunch of Romans until we face a boss. We need to win against all of them. We are not good enough for this, I believe. Nah, we are not good enough. A character that has beaten the game to have a chance. We could try the normal Medea instead. Today we shall recreate the battle that crossed the sea, the war against Hannibal of Carthage, the legendary battle of Sama. The hero Scipio Africanus will show the barbarians the power of Rome. The gladiator who shall play as Hannibal Barca will attempt to break through the Roman encirclement. So we need to defeat three Romans and then there comes another group of three Romans and the two continue until we face a boss. We need to win against all of them. Done. Perfect. Yeah, she's really fun to play as this guy. This girl. That horse is also dangerous. Should avoid the tracks. Ah, there we have Romans. Fuck you! Fuckers! Didn't go well the second round. I got hit too many times. Yeah. <laughs> 
Kivon shouldn't have tried parrying, he should have just attacked. But I believe they would have sent another group. Let's try again. I don't care about the intro. We'll attack! I still prefer the, the, the attacks of this character over many of the others. I like having two weapons and being able to run around and kick at the all sides. I like acrobatic characters. It's more fun than some others. The game is much more fun when you have a leveled up character. Battles are much more epic. Damage it has like a skyzer blade. Woo! 
Fuck you. Fuckers! Die! Yeah, you feel really powerful when you play a leveled up character like this. She's so fast that, uh, that it feels really powerful. And I like playing as her because she's really good. Good. Kill them! Now we have a boss! Disarmed him! He picked up his sword, but he didn't pick up his helmet. Which is good, because we don't want him to have a uh, defense. Fuck you! Fuck you! He picked up a helmet. Took him down. Victory. Nice. I have never finished this before. Tried it yesterday with this character, but I failed. Greater seat chain 23. Accurate attacks. Unable to dodge at all. Crowd pleaser. Nice. Yeah, this was my best uh, play of this game yet. But as you see, when a character is leveled up, has uh, a lot of health, vitality, a lot of endurance, skill power points and a lot of strength then she's really good but uh, if you have too little skill then then she can't do her uh, skill attacks a lot in a battle that's why the other character is so weak despite having the same skills she can't do them a lot in a battle here I could spam them and she's really effective she uh, moves around and kicks and stuff and, and you can easily turn around and kick the ones on the side and such so yeah, she's re really powerful and fun to play as. Well, the <coughs> the character I'm playing in the story mode is not as fun because she doesn't have the skills required to be this good. So I, I need to level her up before she will be as good as this character. Uh, so without money sheet, I believe that it would take a longer time to get her equipment and such. So by using a money sheet, I can... Uh, <coughs> can get her equipment sooner but I still need to have the weight uh, number in order to carry everything so I am not able to carry all her equipment until I have leveled up enough so I still couldn't equip it however having a money sheet on enables me to heal myself all the time which is, is a little bit um, boring but at the same time uh, the, the risk of getting a game over is decreased uh, I would still get game over if I uh, fail at doing a certain thing in the storm mode three times. For example, if I lose a battle three times without winning, without having a victory, then, then I will get game over. Then we can just uh, load the save game and try again. Uh, so the money sheet allows us to heal ourselves uh, uh, a lot because we have a lot of money. And we can buy the equipment immediately, but we can't equip it because we need uh, strength at a certain number before we can equip everything and even when we have everything equipped we need the uh, skill level at, uh, at 209 in order to be as good as this one and health at 209 as well so we need skill at 209 health vitality at 209 uh, and, uh, and we need uh, the, the strength at uh, 269 to be at this character's level. Okay, that was an epic battle.
this character was really fun. There are other wars too, like the and Actium, Lysia, Sicilian, Jugunte, and German. I tried the German playing as the other female character, the the Gaulish one, Albel. Albel. But uh, yeah, we won't do that now. Thank you for watching. I'm gonna go and eat dinner now. Uh, then I will probably continue. Uh, okay, thank you for watching. Bye.